So, you got a whopper of a check, huh? Let's face it, giant checks are exciting. Maybe it's a bonus, a sale of something special, or maybe grandma finally coughed up that inheritance, fingers crossed. But then reality hits, how do you deposit this bad boy? Especially if your bank is Capital One, known for its sleek app and digital focus. Fear not, fellow check-wielding warriors. Capital One offers a few ways to get that windfall into your account, and this video will walk you through all of them. First, let's talk about that check itself. Because before you even consider a deposit method, there are a few crucial things to keep in mind. Make sure you have a valid ID and that the check is properly endorsed. That means flipping it over, signing your name on the back, and writing for Capital One Mobile Deposit if you plan on going the digital route. More on that later. Now, onto the depositing fun. Option 1. Conquering the Capital One Branch there's something undeniably satisfying about a face-to-face -face transaction. Maybe you like the human interaction or the guarantee of immediate access to the funds. If that's you, then head down to your local Capital One branch. Find one near you using their handy branch locator on the Capital One website, Capital One Branch Locator, and be sure to check their hours before you go. Once you're there, grab a deposit slip and fill it out carefully. Include your account number, the check amount, and any necessary memo details. Then, wait in line, hopefully it's short, approach the teller with a smile, and they'll handle the rest. They might ask to see your ID for verification, so be prepared. Option 2. The ATM Advantage Maybe you're short on time or the idea of branches just doesn't tickle your fancy. No worries. Many Capital One ATMs accept check deposits. Just make sure it's a Capital One ATM, not a generic one you might find at a gas station or convenience store. These ATMs usually have clear instructions on the screen, but here's a quick rundown. Insert your debit card, enter your PIN, choose the deposit option, select the account you want the money to go into, and follow the prompts to feed the check into the machine. Double check the amount on screen before finalizing the deposit, and voila, you're good to go. Option 3, the mobile marvel, with limits. Here's where things get interesting. Capital One, known for its app-centric approach, offers mobile deposits. This is fantastic for those who value convenience and staying in their pajamas. But there's a catch, there are daily and monthly deposit limits. You can find these limits by logging into your Capital One mobile app and navigating to the deposit section. If your check amount whooshes past those limits, then you'll need to resort to one of the other methods we discussed. Assuming your check falls within the mobile deposit limits, fire up the Capital One app and find the deposit function. The app will guide you through the process, which usually involves snapping clear pictures of the front and back of the endorsed check. Make sure there's good lighting and a flat surface for the best results. The app will then ask you to confirm the amount and might even let you add a memo. Once everything looks good, submit the deposit and wait for the funds to appear in your account. The app will usually give you an estimated time frame for when the deposit will be available. Remember, with mobile deposits, it's crucial to keep your endorsed check safe until the funds are fully deposited into your account. Once that happens, shred the check for security purposes. So, there you have it. Three ways to deposit your hefty check into your Capital One account. Whether you crave the personal touch of a branch visit, the efficiency of an ATM, or the convenience of your phone, Capital One has you covered. With that said, thanks for watching and until next time.